This is a knot system that I use possibly more than any other. It involves a directional figure eight and a slippery half hitch or quick release that is locked off. It's used for tensioning two points together, like the end of your canoe that's on top of your car, tensioning it to the tie down loops on the bottom of your car. So, you start with a directional eight, directional figure eight, and that's tied in line on a line that upwards of the figure eight is tied off, deadheaded with say a bowline or something else that fixes the end of that line to whatever you want to tension on that end. On the other end, you're passing the rope through some kind of loop, in this case carabiner. And then you take the tail end of that rope and pass it through that figure eight. Now, to tension these two ends together, all you have to do is pull on this. And since you're passing through a figure eight, a loop that is moving, you've created a pulley. So you get two to one force on your tension. Twice the amount of tension that you pull with your hand goes into this loop and onto that end. So you pull all the tension that you want so you have things as tight as you want. And then you grab this part here, this is your loose end. You just pinch that on your eight. And you'll be amazed at how much force you can hold simply by pinching that together. And now you can take this loose end and you need to lock this off. So what you do is you pass your loose end over its long end and then you want to take a bite from this and pass it up through that hole. So you've created a hole by passing it over the top. Now you take a bite and pass it through from underneath. Then you can cinch that down and now, once that's tight, you've just got this loose end sticking out here, and this knot is now taking all the force that's holding these two points tension together. And you can still even pull a little bit of tail free if you need. Now, when, when you have this and you're ready to release your load, all you have to do is pull on this end. Like that, and it pops out, and you release all tension. No problem untying your knots, even though you put a lot of force on them. So one more time, we pull that tension here, getting the pulley action from this piece. Then you pinch it to hold it still. Then you take your tail end and pass it over the top of its long end. Then you want to take a bite and pass it up through from the underneath of that, or from the other side of that hole that you created. So there's your bite passing through, and then you tighten it down. And you can pull a little bit of extra tail through if you need it. This is now taking all the force, but now you want to lock this off because you don't want a quick release sitting there while you're driving down the road. So all you have to do is take this bite and do the same thing you just did, except we're going to pass it over and then pass the whole thing up through that hole that you created. Now this quick release is locked off and you can drive several hundred miles like this. It won't come loose. As long as your rope isn't too fat or stiff or anything, you have to pay attention to your type of rope. When you're ready to undo it at the end, all you do, this knot has very little tension on it, so all you do is just loosen it up a bit, push that bite back through, and now you have your quick release, and you just pull on your quick release, and everything is unloaded. And you can take your canoe off your car.